Day 4. Agent King here. I'm just outside of camp in Tokyo, Japan. Konnichiwa. In case you didn't know it, Tokyo is the capital of Japan and has the largest population of any city in the world. That's 30 million people in one tiny place. Why, at Shinjuku subway station so many people get on and off at rush hour that there are special subway guards that do nothing except squeeze people into the subway cars during this time. There are over 200 entrances and 3.64 million people use this station alone. There are also some great sights to see here. Tokyo is home to the Tsukiji Fish Market, the largest fish market in the world. Market workers have these little motorized fish crate cards that zip back and forth to carry crates of fish. The new market in 2014 will be over 400,000 square meters. That's a lot of fish. But be careful, if you hang out too long at the fish market, you might end up smelling fishy. A dead giveaway is a secret agent. There are many beautiful, well-maintained temples in Tokyo. The Meiji Shrine memorializes Emperor Meiji as Japanese honor their ancestors. They try to remember the past as well as the present in religion of traditions called Shintoism, which combines both philosophical and spiritual aspects. Another famous temple is called the Senjoji Temple, which is attended by Buddhists. Sadly, not too many people in Japan know about the Bible or our mystery person. Maybe you can change that. Commander Wolf will be passing around a box with a clue to the identity of our secret person. She'll be wearing a stylish kimono, along with her protective sun visor, field shades, and regulation telecommunications headgear. Put your hand in this box today. It has two clues in it. Take a look, jot down the clues, and take down the verse that helps us explain those clues. At the end of the day, we'll check case sheets clues to see what you've gathered. Now let's listen as we hear about something that our secret person has shown to us all. <laughs> 